Welcome to Scott's Beer Review, where I sample craft beers. It is Mambo number five. Let's see what's in this brown bag. Today we have from Phillips Brewing and Malting Company, Shortwave West Coast Pale Ale. Pretty cool can, 5.2%. Uh, their slogan is unconventional since 2001. It's on the lighter side of the beers. It's about midway through their hops level and partway up their malt level. So shortwave kind of radio style. Scan through the static and discover the shortwave. This wireless beer transmitter features an uncensored malt body electrified with bright citrus hops, dialed in and balanced. Enjoy this frequency frequently. Let's crack this one open. Nice, nice. Look at that. So more on the gold and orange side of color. Yeah, right away you can tell there's hops in it. It's not overwhelming though. It's a nice flavor, I think. But I have grown to accept hops in my life because quite a few craft beers do it, especially with more of the IPAs, which I haven't grown to like yet. But this is a pale ale. It's pretty good. It's not blowing my mind away, so it's not going to be in that four range. It's a pretty serviceable beer. I think it's below three compared to what I've had that I called the three. I think this is just below that. Very serviceable though. I think I would buy it. It's so close to that territory. It's not, it's not my favorite. I'll put it that way. I'll give it a solid two eight and call that a review. Uh, thank you for watching. If you want to see more stuff like this, like, comment, subscribe, share it, do whatever. And I'll see you next time. I'm going to finish this one off.